And let me mention one thing that's very important for the youth to understand. Very, 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 very important. This mentality that one day I'll get religious and everything is magically going to turn around. And I'll be able to straighten my life out and everything will be great. Meaning I can fool around now and then I'll get a little older and I'll finish doing whatever I need to do. And then I'll get married to the most beautiful girl in the world and I'll have the most beautiful wedding in the world and everything will be great. We'll take all the pictures and everything like that and everything is smooth sailing from there. Allah says pure men are her pure women. You know what usually happens to guys who flirt, who act in a very, very inappropriate way and then already pre-planned their sins? How? When you get to a point that you're planning your sins in advance, you're not even falling into them, you're already planning your sins in advance. And you say, I'll fix it later on, then I'll get married and everything will be okay and there wasn't sincere repentance. Guess what? He finds out that his wife also had the same issues in the past too. She used to act the same way. Because I'm talking about girls because that's the most major for how long relationships. The sisters also suffer with the brothers. The most major problem, not problem, symptom of the bigger problem being. Right? Is I'm just gonna somehow break out of this magic thing. You'll still have the effect. You'll still have the effect of it. Because Allah says pure men are for pure women. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is not going to give you, you know, the, the Muslim version of, of Jasmine. <laughs> and you're not Prince Ali. And everything falls into place and it's a whole new world. <laughs> it's not like that. It doesn't work that way. And if you're playing the song in your head, say stuff for Allah right now. Stop. <laughs> The point is, is that you still will have to live with the effect of it. But if you make a sincere repentance, then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give you something better and Allah will support you. And Allah will give you the strength, inshaAllah ta'ala, to get over it.